Hello, Internet! This is Angry Mojo Games with another assembly tutorial. Today, we have our paint racks. Specifically, we have our circular paint racks, and this one is for round dropper bottles, the type that you'll find in Reaper and Vallejo paints, as well as Army Painter and anyone else who uses those little plastic dropper bottles. Like all of our kits, it comes in as a big old pile of wood. This is a very easy build. So the first thing you're going to do, and this is going to take a while considering you've got all these little gaps, is to make sure to clean it along the edges with some rubbing alcohol and a cloth to get all the soot out from inside. It's very important because otherwise sometimes the glue will not adhere properly. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to form the structure of the paint rack. Taking some wood glue, because we love wood glue here, we're going to line up here. Run a line down there. Sock it in, like so, and you've got your base. Next, we're going to go and take this piece. We're going to go and put a little bit of glue here. Don't worry about using too much. It's on the bottom. And I don't think many people are planning on doing very much painting of their paint racks. But in the event you want to, <clears throat> you'll want to make sure that your glue is not beating up too badly. So, I'm going to make sure that the sockets all go in. Press down. Voila. Now, my table is not exactly uh, level, so I'm going to hold it up and show you how that works. Or I'll just put it on the angle like that. That works too. Next, we're going to go and take this section, and on the underside, just periodically along. We're going to go put a little dab of glue. Now we don't want, this is where you don't want to put too much because otherwise it'll beat up underneath these holes where the paint's going to go. Then your paints aren't going to sit flat, which means they'll fall over. Now I know this looks like it's very, very uh, slim and uh, it does fit pretty snug. Holds the paints up a lot better than you'd think. We'll go ahead and put up a video. Uh, we have some small lazy Susans we put these things on so they'll spin. But, very, very simple. That goes on. Next, let's go ahead and put more glue on here. Same deal again. Doesn't take that much. And then for the final tier, we go ahead and put some glue here, 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 and here. Put the base on. And then finally, some glue here. Dab will do you. Whenever you're gluing flat MDF to flat MDF, you do not need very much. And there you go. Now, go ahead and make sure that we don't have any glue coming into here. If you do, just scoop it up with your finger and your fingernail. And there we have a paint rack that's going to hold a whole lot of paint. Meantime, we're Angry Mojo Games. Happy gaming and enjoy your painting. 